here today. I hope you've had a great, great, great week. Uh, what have you guys been up to? Uh, let me know. <laughs> All right, we're just going to say a quick word of prayer and we're going to go right into it, okay? Good. Dear Lord, thank you very much for today. Thank you, Lord, for how you've kept us and protected us throughout the week. Lord, we pray that even as we read your word today and learn about you, that you will be with us. Help us to know you more today, Lord, in Jesus' name. And everybody says, Amen. All right, children, we're going to sing a song, and this song will always remind you that you have the light of God in you, shining bright and bright, okay? All right, let's go. tribe of Judah, and I have filled him with the Spirit of God, with wisdom, with understanding, with knowledge, and with all kinds of skills, to make artistic designs for work in gold, silver, and bronze, to cut and set stones, to work in wood, and to engage in all kinds of crafts. Moreover, I have appointed Olia, son of Aisamak, of the tribe of Dan, to help him. Also, I have given ability to all the skilled workers to make everything I have commanded you, the tent of the meeting, the ark of the covenant law with the atonement cover on it, and all the other furnishings of the tent, 
the table and its articles, the pure gold lampstand and all its accessories, the altar of incense, the altar of burnt offering and all its utensils, the basin with its stand, and, and also the woven garments, both the sacred garments for Aaron the priest and the garments for his sons, when they serve as priest, and the anointing oil and fragrant incense for the holy place. They are to make them just as I commanded you. Amen. All right. Remember Moses who God used to part the Red Sea and lead the Israelites out of Egypt from slavery? You remember? I know you do. God gave him instructions to build a special tent where he would leave. He taught Moses to speak to two workers, Bezalel and Oliab. God had given them the skills they needed to do the work. All the people brought supplies and Bezalel and Oholiab guided the workers. With God's help, the people built a beautiful home for God to live among his people. All right, guys, I want you to always remember that you're special and unique, just like how each snowflake is unique. If you see this snowflake and the ones behind me, they look the same. They're all white, but they have different shapes. And each one, each one is unique. So the amount of snow that falls, the billions of snowflakes there are, each one is special and unique in its shape. It's the same way, the way there are billions of people on earth. Each person is special, different, and unique. I want you to always remember that. Also, you see these gifts? They look so good and precious, right? You should always remember that you have a special gift. Only that this time, it's inside of you. God has put in you a special gift that you can use to do his work. So the gift inside of you, you can give it to God and, you know, he can use it to do his work. All right, guys. So two things I want you to remember today. You're special and unique and you have a special gift where? On the inside of you. Don't forget that. Awesome. So now we're going to go right into our memory verse and it's going to be from Matthew chapter 5. Verse 16. Can you repeat that after me? Matthew chapter 5, verse 16. And it goes this way In the same way, let your light shine before others, that they may see your good works and glorify your Father who is in heaven. Can we say that together again? Matthew chapter 5, verse 16. In the same way, let your light shine before others, that they may see your good works and glorify your Father who is in heaven. Amen. All right, guys. Let's say a quick word of prayer. Dear Lord, thank you very much for teaching us from your word today. Lord, help us to always remember that we are special and unique and that there is a gift that you've put in inside of us to serve you. Lord, bless our week and protect us and be with us. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. And everybody says, Amen. Praise the Lord. All right, guys, we've come to the end of our video for today. I hate to go, but we will see you again soon for sure. I hope you have a great, 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 great week, and see you next time. Bye.